Hi ladies and gentlemen, this is Tony Hollowitz and I want to thank you for being here for this tutorial. Previously, we had talked about Bill Gates and let's say we get a phone call from Bill Gates. We did a look up and act and we're sitting here in our demo database for these videos and we realized that Bill Gates is part of a company called the ABC Company and I see the company name right here. But one of the things I'm observing is that the ABC Company is blue and it has a hyperlink. In other words, it has a line under it. By observing that, I can go over and click on this hyperlink and be taken into a company area with an act. You'll notice down here on the left-hand side, there's something called companies. So what this tells me is that Bill Gates is part of a bigger company called the ABC Company. And let's assume for a minute that I'm having a conversation with Bill Gates and I'm trying to learn a little bit more about what's going on with his company. And because he's part of a different company, because all of these things are linked together for all these individuals at this particular company, I can come up and click on the Activities tab and view all the activities that are scheduled at that company. Sales opportunities, I can view that, any particular kind of opportunity. History, Notes. If I've attached a document to any one of those contacts, I'll see it here. I'm going to jump ahead a little bit to the company profile. You can add some specific information here. Company access, maybe you want to limit people that have access to this particular company. If there's any divisions or subdivisions of this company, maybe they have divisions in different parts of the country. And as I had mentioned, with different add-on software and QuickBooks, you can view things such as invoices, sales orders, all of that information right there within ACT. So knowing how to work with companies and realizing that the company's feature in ACT centralizes a lot of information into one place will make you recognize that companies can be very effective to use and to work with within ACT. And I'm trying to give you an overview to give you some ideas on how you can think about this. As I've said all along, I do believe that the most important part of ACT is the visual clue that this hyperlink gives you that this person, this individual, if you had just look, looked up this person as an individual, would be you'd realize that it was part of a bigger company instead of maybe just the only contact at that company. It's just a clue. So I think that's a good thing. In our upcoming tutorials, we will discuss companies in greater detail and show you some more information about how to work with them. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tony Hollowitz, and I want to thank you for being here. Have a great day. Bye now.